Hallelujah, beloved. Today is another day by the Almighty Jehovah. So, beloved, we owe him. We have to pray and thank him. So, with one accord, let us thank our Maker, our Lord Jesus Christ. Shall we pray? The King of Glory, your sovereignty is forever and forever. Mighty Lord, the Savior, the one who paid for our sins. Father, we thank you. We magnify your name. You are the owner of life. So this is another day. We are still breathing. Thank you, Jehovah, for giving us another day. We owe you a thanks. We owe you a praise. We owe you a worship. Only you alone can do this for your children around the world. So may your name be exalted and praised. Forever, O oh Lord, your word is settled in heaven. In Jesus Christ, your mighty name, I have prayed with thanksgiving. Amen. Beloved, this is another day. And when a day like this, he has given to us, we have to thank him. So also, I take this opportunity to greet the viewers of Prophet Kanew for availing yourself in a daily basis to listen to end time prophets. May God Almighty, Jehovah, King of glory, bless you all and protect you as you have availed yourself. Amen in Jesus' name. Beloved, let us go to the scripture. That is the title of the message. God hates the wicked people. So shall we turn our Bibles to Psalm 140 and let us hear the word of God. We give him all his glory. And may the Holy Spirit deliver us from the wicked men and the wicked Satan and his demons. So shall we read Psalm 140. Deliver me, O Lord, from the evil men. That's why the title of the message says, God deliver me from the wicked men. Preserve me from the violent men. Two, who plan evil things in their hearts. Beloved, all their ways is so wicked. All their hearts is so evil. And all their intentions are nothing but wicked to harm a human soul. That is the work of the enemy. And some people are working for him. So that's why they are evil men. Let us continue. They continually gather together for war. They are sharpening their tongues like a serpent. The poison of us is under their lips. Beloved, Satan come to steal, to destroy, and to kill. That's why these wicked men, they are nothing, but they are enemies to us. So they are working for their master, that is Satan. 
and his demons. Let us continue. Verse four, keep me, O Lord, from the hands of the wicked. Preserve me from the violent men. Only God, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Nisi, can protect you and I from these wicked men as they are busy working for their master, Lucifer. But with God, all things are possible. Hallelujah. Let us continue. Who have proposed to make my step slumber? Yes, they want us to fall. But you know why? The children of the Most High God that has accept Christ as their personal savior and also set themselves aside for Christ only cannot fall. They cannot slumber because they work for the king of kings, because the savior, the protector, guide them in a daily basis. Because the Holy Spirit in the children of the most high God are greater, that spirit of God is greater in us. So beloved, these violent men, they were not we, because our king of glory, the mighty Lord, he is in control over his children. Let us continue. Five, the proud have hidden a snail for me and a cord. Yes. Very soon, the year is getting to the end with their dirty tricks and also their plans. They want to destroy a soul that they have not created. So they will take all means with their dirty tricks, but with gold, all things are possible. The mighty Jehovah is in control. Beloved, let us continue. They have spread a net by the wayside. These are all his tricks. Satan and his wicked men and his demons. Yes, they lay a net by the wayside. But beloved, they themselves will fall into it because the Holy Spirit in us knows us. He searches the deeper things of God. So he knows us. So far as we communicate, so far as we are in tune with the Holy Spirit in a daily basis, they themselves Whatever pits, whatever they have laid, the nets, they themselves will fall into it. Hallelujah. They have set a trap for me and you. Beloved, that's all they do. They want you and I to fall. But Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Nisi, he is in control our life. I want to minister a song. And this is how the song goes. He's in control all over the world. Master Jesus, he's in control. He's in control all over the world. Master Jesus, he is in control, he is in control all over the world. Master Jesus, he is in control. 
what a great Jehovah, the mighty one. We continue verse six. I said to the Lord, you are my God. Hear the voice of my supplication, O Lord. Beloved, he knows his children. The more we cry to him, he knows us. He will hear our voice because he is our Lord. He is our King. He is our shepherd. So beloved, he knows his children. Seven, oh God, the Lord, the strength of my salvation. Beloved, salvation, he alone has it. And salvation is physical because Christ was killed physical. So salvation is the physical thing as you have accepted him in spirit and in truth. Hallelujah. You have covered my head in the day of battle. Only the Holy Spirit can help us because he is greater than them. And at the battlefield, he knows us. And Christ has done it for you and I. He has won the battle 2,000 years ago. So the enemy, whatever he does, he is defeated, Satan and his demons. So this afternoon, the battle failed. We will not stop. We will continue to pray and pray and pray to Almighty Jehovah. Till the trumpet sound, we serve a mighty God, the one who formed you and I. What a great master. We continue, verse 8. Do not grant, O oh Lord, the desire of the wicked. Our God will not grant them so that they can get us. No, we serve the mighty God, the one who forms you and I. If you obey him, if the Holy Spirit, your comforter, be your guide, no demon, no principality can win the battle because our king, our Lord, our savior has won the battle 2000 years ago. So beloved, the spirit in us, that is the Holy Spirit, is greater than that is in the world. That is outside. That is Satan and his demon. The Holy Spirit, our comforter, our teacher, our guide, our friend, is so mightier than the wicked ones. Beloved, let us continue. Do not further his wicked scheme. Least they will be exalted. No, the wicked scheme, it will never function. We continue. Nine. As for the head of those who surrender me, let the evil of their lips cover them. Whatever they plan, it will be sent back to them, their wicked ways, the wicked men, the ones that work for Satan and his demons. It is time for them to change and come and serve the almighty Lord, the one who created them. So this morning, it is time for the wicked men to repent and surrender their life to Christ Almighty Jehovah. He formed them. Satan don't have anything for them, but they are working for Satan and his demons. May God have mercy for the wicked men, the wicked souls, 
it is time for them to repent. Tomorrow will be too late. We thank the almighty Lord as he has given us a message. With God, all things are possible. Today is repentance for those who are so wicked, the wicked men, to change their ways, to come and serve the almighty Lord. May they turn their ways because God knows them and their days are numbered. So beloved, those who does not know Christ, today is the day to accept Christ as your personal savior. As the trumpet will sound any moment and that day, you are heading to your master's place and your master's place is nothing but hell. So this morning, may God change your mind and your thoughts. Holy Spirit, have mercy upon us because you are our protector, our guide, our friend, our teacher. We give you all the glory. Master, we thank you, covenanted God. What you have done for us today, it is only your mercy. We appreciate you, King of glory, our Lord, our Savior. Hallelujah. I take this opportunity, Holy Spirit, may you protect your end-time prophet, Prophet Kenneth, the wife, the children, and also his viewers. May their hard desire be met. What is Savior? We give you all the glory for giving us a day like this and also a message like this. Hallelujah. In Jesus Christ, your mighty name, your message has come. Amen.